Hey guys, Jason Cipriani here, a CNET how-to contributor. Today we're going to discuss the iPad as well as iOS 5, and more specifically we're going to discuss the new split keyboard feature that's coming to the iPad with iOS 5. Let's take a look at how it works. Alright, to show you how to use a split keyboard on iOS 5 running on an iPad 2, what we're going to do is we're going to launch Pages. We have an open document here with the full-size keyboard that users have grown accustomed to. What we're going to do is put two fingers on the screen and pull to each side in the middle of the keyboard. What this does is it actually splits the keyboard into two different parts. This allows for quick and easy access without having to reach clear across the screen with your thumbs or your fingers. And it works both in portrait and landscape mode. You can even move the keyboard up and down, pull it all the way back down, and it'll dock it. You can split it again and put it back together. So that's a split keyboard on iOS 5. So as you just saw, the split keyboard feature on iOS 5 for the iPad is going to be extremely easy to use. Users can expect to get their hands on it later this fall when Apple officially releases it. That's it. For more fun tech tips, make sure to visit howto.cnet.com.